Over the past few years, we've ordered tons of haunted fish mystery boxes. And every single time, it never fails to amaze us. Baby Ani, they like babies. Parents, hide your kids, man. That can right there. Look at that, the head just came off. Oh my god, I see something in there. It's an egg. It's an egg? I swear to god, I see something in there. It's squirting to me, actually. <laughs> I think that's another, that's another shark, shark egg. egg. That All is black. insane. Uh, tell me that's not a fart Ooh. substance. Water, fish. So clearly, we're not strangers to creepy things you can buy on the internet. Now we're back at it with another haunted live fish mystery box. So let's see what's inside. All right, guys, me and Jack today. Jack's walking into the post office right now to pick up some brand new boxes, some mystery boxes that we just ordered. We're picking them up today, and we're going to see what's inside, baby. We haven't done one of these in a long time. Once he comes out, we're going to see what we're working with. Hopefully something good, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get some good mystery box action today. Two boxes. <laughs> Two boxes, bro. Two, baby. Today's Two the big day. Live tropical fish. We got two boxes and they're heavy. We are pumped. Let's see what's in these boxes. Hopefully something good. Here we go, ladies and gents. Double packages. This is a rare. This is a very rare. We never get two boxes. There must be some really nice big fish in here. That's what we're hoping for. Guys, I'm fired up. It's been forever. It's been forever since we've done a video like this and ordered something of this like excitement, lot. you know? Like, we don't know what it is, baby. It's a good feeling. Last time we got this disgusting Oof. smelling, literally it was grotesque. It was like an was oyster terrible. or something with pearls inside of it. Mm. I don't know what we did with those, with those pearls. I think they were worthless. I think they're in my drawer. Are they still in your drawer? I think they might be. They don't smell. Really? So, you know, bad. I'm waiting for the time when they sell out of oysters and there's only a limited amount and then they go up in value. There you go. So maybe we could have another oyster in here. You never know. Let's open these boxes. Let's see what's inside. Very watery. Get this first box open. I'm pumped that we have two, guys. You know, it's like open up a pack of Pokemon. You don't know what's in the inside. Know. Could be a Charizard. Could be a Charizard. Could be a one of one Joe Burrow. Don't know. Ooh, Ooh baby. We got some Ooh, big bags. baby. Big bags. We wow. have a big bag and a nice fish in there. Huh? We have a nice fish in here. Now you guys never know. We don't know exactly what fish they're giving us, so you always gotta be careful. Looks venomous. <laughs> Three, two, one. What is hold that? Hold in the back, hold in the back, hold in the back, hold in the back. Is it a lion wicked, fish? wicked. It's some sort of rock fish? I think that's a scorpion fish. Scorpion Again. fish? That is a venomous fish. That's a venomous fish. This we were, can kill you. We were manhandling the bag. Yeah, look at it from below. Look at it from below. Super red. You can see all the spikes along the outside. Oh, if you get one of those spikes, you're toast, bro. You're actually this comes dead. with like a warning or something? You're actually dead. Imagine if the average guy buys this and they're like, oh, look, it's a freaking red fish. Picks it up. Dead. This is, a, this is a venomous fish. Thousand percent. One million percent. Should we put them in the, in let's the put thing? Them, let's put them in the thing so you guys can get a better look at them. It looks like a lionfish almost. There he oh is. God. Let me get the ring That thing is so weird, bro. Where are we going to put him? Dude, I that is... That is like just so crazy because they blend right in with the rocks. So you don't no. even see it, dude. That's a red alert. That's a red alert. There's a hair in the bag too. Ew, that's disgusting. Gross. Oh, see him when he, he see those spines in the back? Yeah, that'll that'll mess. Right there. Up. See those spines when I'm touching it like that? Oh, yeah. That is uh, that's what he does. He, I wonder if he's a jumper. He pops his fins up, just like that, and he'll spike anything that goes near him. I don't even like it. I think it's ugly. It's, it's disgusting. Are we gonna keep it? I think we put him in there until we figure out what we want to do with it. In here? No. If he harms Sponge, I will personally I think it's the bomb him as that. Sponge could eat him easily. Oh, it would suck him down. Yeah, we, we're not putting him with Sponge. No. Zero percent chance. We gotta put him in there. All right, guys, I just found it online. That's it right there. This is actually a type of scorpion fish, but it's called the devil. The devil scorpion so you fish. know he's a bad man. So this thing will send you right down to hell if you touch it, that's yeah. for sure. This thing has, you know, the venomous spines, just like all the scorpion fish. That's why you gotta be super careful around these guys. I don't like the fact that he's just sitting in this bucket. <laughs> if he leaps and hits my big toe. You're dead. Fish guy Chris You're is dead. out of commission. Going to hell. Straight, straight to the hospital. Put him in the tank. Jack, I got the big net. Just let me- Take Oh my god! He's a jumper, dude. He will get your arm. I got him! I got him! Wait! Oh, Shut up. Right. He's in the tank. That was dangerous. I don't know what we're gonna do with him, but I don't even like him. Now, is there venom in the water? Can we touch it? I don't even want to touch it. Okay. I don't, don't want to touch, touch it either. All right, next bag. Either. Next bag, guys. I don't want to touch it. Why do people buy those? I don't know. People, pro I don't know. Like, we had a freaking biohazard tank. That's why. Because there's people like us that are freaking whack jobs. Look at this, guys. <laughs> we got the ghost shrimp. Basically, I think what they did was 
They gave us this as food to feed to him. Maybe. But instead of doing that, we're gonna feed it to our beloved sponge. Yeah. Is there venom in that net now? Change nets. Change nets. Change garbage nets. this one. As you guys can tell, we're very overthinkers. I'm sorry, that is going in the garbage. That net is going right in the garbage. We cannot risk our lives for Got a new one. stupid fish. Got a new one. Now, ghost rims, yeah, they definitely sent these guys to feed to him. For sure. But, you know, who do we care about more? Sponge the angler. There's actually a lot in here. We're also gonna give some to the baby shark. He actually loves ghost shrimp. You guys are gonna see him eat for the first time. He's in the bedroom still because Sponge would actually eat him in two seconds. Literally devour. So let's see if he wakes up a bit once he feels the shrimp moving around and see if he'll smoke some. That shot. In the meantime, our boy, can you even tell he's there? He's blend, he blends in perfectly with that rock. It's insane. There's so many. There's so many. Come on, Spongy. Full. Guys, the baby shark is starting to smell the shrimp. As you guys can see, we got a little bit of activity going on inside his bedroom. It's a mission for him to catch those things because they're fast and he's quite slow, but he's still learning to hunt and this gives him something to do all day. Oh, here we go, come on. You got the antenna. That's a big one too. It's got eggs, extra protein. Come on, get it boy. Get, oh! Oh, he's so slow. I think he's a nighttime hunter. He's a nighttime hunter. When the shrimp are asleep, he's, he's devouring. Get oh! Devoured. Guys, I think Sponge is just, he's, he's spoiled. He's spoiled rotten. He's literally spoiled rotten because we feed him fish like this big. Right, so he's mouth. like, I'm not gonna eat that ghost shrimp anymore. So now we know we gotta get him something bigger. Big fish only. To feed him. Big fish energy, that's literally. Sponge's mindset at all times. Big fish energy, exactly. But box number one is done and box number two is right here. Let's do it. We did get a venomous fish in the first box, so there could be a king cobra up in this. King cobra, yeah. Imagine, king cobra. Here we go. Dun, 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 dun. Here we go. Okay. okay, first thing, couple couple nice mice. Ew. Now, Ew. what is that to feed? What is that to feed? Exactly. exactly. Is that That's to feed what your mind has to go to. That's what you, they sent us the, the ghost shrimp to feed the devil fish, and now they're sending us the rats to feed the king cobra. That's or the actually, Mamba. that makes too much sense to not have a king cobra in the bottom. Okay, of let's box. set these aside. Larry and Fitz here. Larry and Fitz. Two of them. That sucks, they just drown them with no care in the world. Uh, my hypothesis is that this, Holy sh oh, oh my, my god. god! A whole lobster. Is That's this thing why alive? They have ice packs in here. Look, ice pack. Shut the Look door. at the size of this Earl. There's no way this thing's alive. We're naming it Earl. <laughs> There's no way this thing's alive. Right? Holy crap! Look at the claws on that thing. Should I open this bag? Open it. Rip it. Okay, this is the first. We've never gotten this before. He's so cold. He's so cold. I think they have to be in cold water. He's bro. so Watch cold. Watch those claws, oh god, Jack. He's, He's fully alive. He's fully alive. <laughs> Oh At least they had some respect and put the freaking rubber bands on. That's insane. Look oh at that. Oh my god, he's huge. I saw these going before. Look he's at the size of this huge. Earl. He's a lot. Yeah, yeah, look at him, look at him. Look right here, look right here. Oh my god. He's got his little filters going. He looks filters. delicious. Guys, we don't have a chilled tank currently. <laughs> if you guys want to see us keep something like this, look at the size of his claw. It's as big as, basically, it's my hand. That's a huge Look at him, he's moving dude. it, he's moving. I think we need to set up a lobster tank. Duh! This I is Earl! Drop a like, guys. At 10,000 likes, I think it's a must. If you I guys, love him. If you guys wanna see us do it, we have to do it for you guys. The problem is, getting a tank that's chilled like that is really expensive, so if you guys wanna see it, we'll make it happen. Dude, that lobster tail is so going in our belly. We have to eat that. I mean, if we have nowhere to put them, we're eating it. He's, he's so safe cold. to eat that? Do these things pinch? Let's find out. <laughs> yeah, they do. <laughs> I don't know very hard though. No, not hard. Not hard? No, dude? he's got me right now. Not hard. No! Ah! Dude, I want to put him in here. Come on, imagine. Imagine he's just chilling there. Imagine we Look have a lobster. Oh, <laughs> I love this guy. I'm, I, wish I love him. I wish we had a lobster tank, bro. I'm pissed. What do we do about him? I don't know what we're going to do with him. Look at the size of this freaking claw, dude. Oh, oh my, my god. What can we have him squeeze? What can oh we have him squeeze? Okay. Yeah, look, he already squeezed it. Give him something, Chris. Oh my god. This? Put your finger in there. Ha! No, he will crush your finger. Give me something. This is the big boy's yeah, yeah, Oh my Now it's it's game on. I wonder what he's thinking. You put your hand in there, you're toast, bro. Bro, get a carrot. Get something. Are you serious, dude? Wow, nice strength, buddy. Earl. Earl, what are you doing, Earl? You gotta Maybe crack that thing. Earl. Dude, he's got it. Does he? He's got it. <laughs> I want him to crack it. Don't get your finger in there. Give me my carrot, boy. I love Earl. I like Earl. We have nowhere for Earl to live. Honestly, there's only one thing to do and that's I did not expect to get a freaking lobster. Maybe if we knew what we were getting, we would have had a tank set up for him. I think we have to eat him. 
Dang it. Out of respect for him. That's what he's meant to do. Guys, let us know by dropping a like. I think we need to redeem Earl with a tank for him. And we need a lobster tank in here, we need, man. We need, we need a lobster tank. It says they can live up to 24 hours in a damp newspaper, guys. Okay, we, have we can hours save hours. Earl. Let's take them all around town. Let's go. We can save. Let's show them the beach. <laughs> guys, I think that's gonna do it for today's video. Dang Be it. sure. To, you know what, do Earl a favor, go check out fishguy.shop. Get yourself something nice, go browse the site. If you like something, just know that when you order, Watch every that. item sold removes trash from the ocean. And I think Earl would really appreciate that. In honor of Earl, I think we need an Earl shirt. I think we need an Earl shirt. I think I'm gonna take him to the beach and- uh, Show him the beach? Show him the beach. All right. <laughs> You're a good guy, knuckles brother. Later. Peace out, guys.